Now, up until a couple of days ago, I never knew who Omele was. Now, if this is some kind of viral marketing campaign to boost e-brand awareness, then well done to him. Hats off to you, sir. But if this ain't that, and she really done that to my man, then I feel sorry for my man, and she belongs to the streets. People, you know what this is. It's your boy Neymar, and I'm a rapper and YouTuber, and I'm back with another big YouTube vid. And on this channel, we deal with everything from music and manosphere and entertainment. And as always, I've got to give you my BS. So let's go. Like I said, if this ain't a publicity stunt, this is the worst way to introduce me to a new artist. Alright, let's check this out, people. Alright, he calls my girl on stage now. Alright, that's her boyfriend in the hat. In the black hat. Ash. Okay. No. No, straight away. Look at that. She looks like she's having a time of her life. That's all silhouetted now. She shouldn't have gone up there, man. That's fuckery. That's straight violation. Look at that. Look at that, people. Back shot, you know. And going down. Look at him. Look at his face. Look at his face. Nah. Nah. The close up as well. What grinding on each other. Wow. Wow. I don't know why he's still there for. I would have bopped. That's what you should have done from before. Fuck you. Fuck you. Look, they're laughing. They're laughing, you know. Now, part of me says my heart goes out to him. And another part of me says, good, you're a simp and you probably saw the red flags from before. But like the old saying goes, if you play with puppies, they'll lick your face. Stop trying to turn these 304s into housewives. And stop calling them queens too. Them girl are not queens. They're village girl. Bosh. And you remember back in the day when things used to hit the tabloids? Red top papers? Now that's the equivalent to going viral these days. And you know she got to tell her side of the story. I'm going to tell my side of the story because the amount of hate that I'm getting, I'm getting I'm getting called all types of things. Like, whoa. I want to publicly apologise to him. Obviously, me and him have had private conversations where we spoke, but since it was public, I think the right thing for me to do is to publicly apologise to him. Like, that was bad. Honestly, a mistake. I just, if I knew this would, like, get this far, I wouldn't even, I wouldn't even go to the concert. I don't know. Also, people saying that he's the one that bought the tickets. Who? See, people, that's why you can't feel sorry for my man. Because you heard it straight from the horse's mouth, yeah? She spoke to him since the event happened. That means he's still in contact with her. See me? That would have got cut off. That would have got cut off straight away. No long thing. I'm not dealing with someone like that. And if she doing shit like that, I bet you any money my man don't chop when he wants to chop. I guarantee you. Listen, I think I said too much, you know. People, if you like the content that man's putting out on a daily basis, don't forget to smash the like and subscribe button. And I'll see you, man, on the next video. Peace.